Hey everyone, and welcome back to the channel. Feeling like your money disappears faster than a magician's rabbit? You're not alone. Today we're unveiling the 5 best ways to save more money. No matter your income level, these strategies can help you build a healthy savings habit and achieve your financial goals. So grab a pen and paper or open your budgeting app because it's time to take control of your finances. Track your spending. Awareness is power. The first step to saving more is understanding where your money goes. Many of us underestimate how much we spend on seemingly small things. Here's how you can track your spending. Use budgeting apps like NERM Money or YNAB, which stands for You Need a Budget. These automatically categorize your expenses, making tracking effortless. You can also choose to go the old fashioned way. Grab a notebook or a spreadsheet and track every expense for a month. It might seem tedious, but it's incredibly eye-opening. According to a nerd wallet study, people that track their spending tend to save twice as much. Embrace budgeting. This is your roadmap to savings. Now that you know where your money goes, it's time to create a budget. A budget is your financial roadmap allocating your income towards expenses and savings goals. Here are some popular budgeting methods. The 50-30-20 rule. This allocates 50% of your income to needs, that is rent and groceries, 30% to wants, entertainment, and 20% to savings and debt repayment. Check out this video that goes into more detail if you're interested. I'll link it below. Zero-based budgeting. Every dollar of your income is assigned a category, needs, wants, and savings, until nothing remains. The National Endowment for Financial Education provides resources on various additional budgeting methods. Prioritize needs versus wants. Not all spending is created equal. Distinguishing between needs and wants is crucial for saving. Needs are essential for surviving, housing, and food, while wants are things you desire but can live without. Fancy coffee and new clothes every season. Here's a trick. The needs test. Ask yourself, could I survive without this? If the answer is yes, it's likely a want and could potentially be cut back or eliminated from your budget. Automate your savings. Set it and forget it. Many of us struggle with the temptation to spend. Here's a simple hack. Automate your savings. Set up automatic transfers from your checking account to your savings account on payday. This pay yourself first approach ensures consistent savings and removes the temptation to spend that money elsewhere. Reduce expenses. Every penny counts. Look for ways to reduce everyday spending across different categories. Groceries. Plan meals, utilize coupons, and explore store brand alternatives. For entertainment. Find free or low-cost entertainment options like picnics, museums on free admission days, or exploring the outdoors. Look for deals on movies or streaming services. Subscriptions. Audit your subscriptions and cancel unused services like gym memberships you never use or music streaming services you forgot about. Bills. Negotiate lower rates for internet, phone, or cable. Shop around for better deals on car insurance. Consider switching to a lower cost phone plan. The Consumer Financial Protection Bureau offers resources for saving money on various household expenses. Remember, saving is a journey, not a destination. Be patient, celebrate small wins, and adjust your approach as needed. There will be setbacks, but consistency is key. Consider setting up multiple savings accounts. One for short-term goals like a vacation, Another for long-term goals, like retirement. 
This helps visualize your progress towards different goals and keeps your savings organized. Thank you for joining me today. Which of these saving strategies resonated most with you? Leave a comment below and share your best money saving tips with the community. Remember, saving money is about taking control of your finances and building a secure future. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more personal finance tips and tricks. And if you're looking for additional resources, check out the links to the video in the description below. See you in the next one.